Hello Aries, this is Carrie from Celestial Forecasts with your five minute mini forecast. So if you've been a regular viewer, these five minute ones will replace the one to three minute ones that I've done previously for the elements and each zodiac will get a five minute mini forecast from here on out. So let's dive right into this general advice as always. I'll be pulling from my Silhouettes deck and grabbing a couple cards from the Pining Rose Love Oracle deck by Calico Moon. And we'll, of course, clarify with some tarot messages. So let's find out when it comes to your romantic partnerships, what is it that you need to know right now? We've got wrinkles, a blueprint life leaves us with to remind us that we loved, we learned, we fell, we got up, we failed, we thrived, we laughed and cried. But most importantly, we lived. So these are things that you can only obtain through time and by really living your life. You know, let's go ahead and grab another. So don't be afraid to live your life ups and downs, the failures and the triumphs. Let's grab another message here. Look at this. We have groom. And whenever I see this card, it really reminds me of the message that somebody wants to grow old with you. And that could be the divine masculine. And it does say, I pledge my love to you from this day forward. That's so beautiful. Let's go ahead and grab a couple cards from here for Aries. What else do we need to know here? So a groom, perhaps, who's ready to go all in, ready for commitment. Marriage, perhaps. Some of you guys could already be married. But then we've got a third party. Wow. And then we have commitment. So here's the thing. If you're married and you're, you've experienced a third party situation, infidelity in your partnership, that could be why this is coming through. Okay, this could also be a canceled engagement, canceled weddings because of infidelity in a partnership. Let's grab some tarot. I'll be pulling from my Illuminated Star Tarot Volume 2. All right, so let's, let's see. So this definitely created division in a partnership. Plans were ruined because of that third party element, that situation, infidelities, trust issues. So even though you've been through a very difficult situation here, Aries, this is a reminder for you to be strong, tap into your inner strength, be courageous. You can make it through however difficult this is. The cards really are coming through very strongly. Look at these cards. Seven of Swords. The Ten of Wands. Okay, so there. this confirms that it could have been a, a Divine Masculine who cheated on the Feminine with a third party situation. And this has been weighing very heavily on this partnership. And Divine Feminine, here you are coming in as the Queen of Wands. So maybe what I'm feeling right now is you guys are in separation. You're just kind of doing your own thing. You're determined to make a life for yourself. Some of you guys could have already had children. The Queen of Pentacles represents a very nurturing maternal energy. And perhaps Divine Feminines, even though you are in separation from your masculine you're able to stand on your own two feet. Maybe financially you're able to provide for yourself. But we do have the magician coming in. So this is manifestation. There's still a possibility for a positive outcome between you and your masculine. And it does indicate a rekindled romance. So even though there could have been infidelities and trust issues and deception in your relationship, whether you were married or not, it does seem here that there is the chance that you guys can work this out. And it absolutely falls on this teamwork, collaboration. They both or both of you have to be just as invested in the partnership, you know, 50-50. And I feel as long as you guys are both willing to work through this, then you can overcome these challenges to be able to 
manifest this reunion here. And then bottom of the deck, we do have the star. So this is a wish that can still be granted, that can still come true for you. All right. So even though there have been challenges, it does seem you can overcome it. All right, Aries. So that's where I'm going to leave that one. If you're interested in your own reading, that info is down below. Thank you so much. See you next time.